hey there, it's home inspection day. But this is my listing, so it begs the question, do listing agents usually come to home inspections? Not typically. But in this specific case, the buyer doesn't have an agent. So this is an opportunity today to just quickly chat about representation. So in these particular cases, when the buyer decides they do not want to use a realtor, you have options. The listing agent has to represent their lister, their seller, and they have to do what's in the best interest of that seller, and they have to follow all the guidelines and so forth within reason that the seller requires of them. After that, the buyer can choose to not rep represent it, and they can go through the whole process, usually guided, because as a selling agent, I want to be sure everything goes smoothly. So I still advise them, and I still walk them through some things to make sure everything continues going smoothly. Smoothly, Because it's ironic that I messed the word smoothly up. Um, I want to make sure everything goes smoothly for my um, sellers. So that guidance is very helpful, and I want to be sure I remain honest and ethical as we do so. So I'm here at the home inspection to make sure everything goes smoothly on behalf of my sellers. There's a form that we have to sign as we go along understanding who the agent represents and when you sign that acknowledging that you know that an agent represents just the seller or just the buyer in a, rep in a, in a deal and that is essentially the legal form that we use and from there you just know that I'm doing the best I can but I represent the sellers or in the opposite it happens once in a while that I'm doing my best but I really represent the buyers so be sure you know that an agent can only represent one side if you have any questions, feel free to reach out 410-708-8858 or the office 410-286-9632. Enjoy this beautiful day. It's snowing-ish, sort of. Stay safe out there and warm. Talk to you soon.